Hi guys, this is Rosa Kelly and today I'm here with a new project to share with you. So let's take a look. So hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. Um, so I am super excited to share with you this new project. I have a zigzag style a mini album and I just really like how these turned out. I'm using the Horse Collection by Stamperia and this is another one of my kits and so you can find them on my website of course together with the video class and so for this book i wanted to create something a little bit different a little bit fun and i really love how this turned out so this book is a nine by seven and as you can see here it has two different spines we have a three inch spine and a two inch spine and we have three different sections on this book and like i mentioned this is a zigzag album so you will see that when we open this up i am in love with this little horse look how cute is she i'm saying she because she has eyelashes and i think she's just so so pretty love the flowers the collection is amazing it has all these beautiful horses flowers and it also has a lot of like nature elements which i really loved and um, so over here on the cover we have some different flowers all of those come in your kit as well um, and of course the seam binding um, the paper again so so pretty and then here is the back we have this gorgeous gorgeous horse oh my goodness i just love it just love how it's gonna like shaded and just really pretty okay so now let's take a look inside so i'm going to untie this but this also has magnets on it so, so when we open this up we have this second um cover which is this horse i just love it so much so this is a wooden horse that came also with your kit and i went ahead and embossed this on gold embossing powder and i put it on the center of this shoe horse or horseshoe <laughs> um shape and i just really love it and then here we have this other smaller section so i'm going to go ahead and open this up all the way and we're going to start with this side so on your video class you will see that this is going to be section a b and c and so let's go ahead and start here um so again with a beautiful beautiful paper it's just so pretty <laughs> i love these horses so then this piece opens up and we have here a large area for a picture here as well you can add a picture right here and then this little horse moves around so you can add your picture and then the horse will go right there and then you can also play around with him and make him jump and then this section opens down here we have another one of those beautiful papers i really love the like sepia tones or black and white pages i think they look really cute um, then here in the center we have these little features so this works multiple ways so this over here opens up and we have one of those like three-dimensional uh, picture areas and then here on the back this is a belly band so then this comes out and then we have another one of the beautiful horse papers you can of course add pictures to that and then this opens um easel car so your picture can be displayed right there but then we can also open this back and then this whole thing will open up like that and then we reveal here this other horse and then this opens like this and i just really love how this page turns out now all of that falls back in place and then we are going to use this um, format as a belly band to keep this area close and then we're going to open this up to the side and then here we have a large area for a picture here as well this opens up one more time let me move this over and then another large area for a picture and then this opens up one more time and so here on the center we have this little feature that opens up like that and we have a cute little pocket in there and then back here we have a large pocket to add more photo mats and then these two sides also open up i didn't cover everything but you can add five by seven pictures on each one of these or just do four by sixes 
and a large one over here and then this will be the same so it opens up and up and up and up so it's like a different type of like a waterfall different type of combo and then we're gonna close this section close this close all of that and that is going to be side a now we're going to move to side b which is my favorite so over here we have the image of this horse which i think is amazing it looks so realistic uh, and then we're going to open this up and then here a room for a picture then we're going to open this down another area for a picture here look how pretty the flowers on this uh, paper and then on the center we have this gorgeous image of this lady with her horse and then we're going to open this up and then we're going to open that up and here on the center we have a shadow box which i think turned out so pretty again i love the nature um background pieces i just really love that and so here we have the name of all the horses i love horses names i think they're just like so magical um, and then this gate opens up like that where you can see the horse you can see here the three-dimensional effect i don't know if you can actually see it on the camera but let me do a quick little zoom and so i just really love playing with that so there's a lot of dimension to that and i just wanted to make it a little bit more realistic and so yeah so i love how that that turned out so now let me zoom you back out and then when we open these two sections we have a little pop-up on each side here so i wanted to keep a lot of areas for pictures but then also add just a little bit of detail and so we have that one and then we have this one so when you open everything up i think it looks really cute with like the shadow box and then we have um areas for pictures and pop-up and then also here on the back behind the shadow box is actually a pocket so you can add a large photo mat in there like a little secret area for a picture this is the paper from a different collection by the way <laughs> and now we're going to close this up close that up close that up and we're going to move to side c so i wanted side c to be more about like adding all Oh, more pictures <laughs> so here we have the beautiful paper that i love um areas for pictures i think you can put two four by fours or you can do a four by six but i'll probably fill this up with four by fours um beautiful horse here again this opens up and so we have another beautiful image of a lady with her horse and then this opens down here we have oh my gosh this was my favorite probably so we have the horse and then we have the like the mommy dog and the little puppies oh, so cute adorable and then here we have the lady with her horse and this opens up one more time and then here in the center we have like a waterfall but this is like a spin-off of a waterfall and i kept all this plain because i know this is gonna get really bulky with pictures so this opens up or to the sides like that and then this opens down so you can fit two four six pictures seven if you put a picture here on each one of those actually eight if you put one on the back so i have three of those here so you can fit again four by four pictures and four by four pictures are actually the size that i print on i just set my phone to take pictures like square pictures and that way you don't have to worry too much about orientation or cropping and so that is going to be that and then here on the side we have a cute little um like opening page like that so again additional areas for pictures so these are four by four so you can see how those will fit in here on this space so you can put a lot of four by fours or four by six and then of course you have the area on the back that i didn't cover um but extra pictures can go in there and so yeah so that is this book i love the collection i think it's so pretty so different and super fun to work with and i hope that you guys enjoy the walkthrough 
and again all the kits will be on my website and if you're new to my channel please do subscribe and i hope to see you guys on the next video bye bye